Therefore, prices were really high. I don't remember hearing much about the vanilla. I don't think I heard anything. That was the first time I heard anything, really. I heard about the tomatoes before. Perhaps society values tomatoes more than vanilla. We don't like vegetables enough. We don't like fruits enough. But somehow tomatoes are valued still. Vanilla is used as a sweetener, the flavor. That says how much we love our tomatoes. Who is the biggest jerk? The public enemy number one during these times. No, it is not the murders or rapists. It is not even the terrorists. It is individuals who take extra tomatoes during a tomato shortage. It's very selfish and very self-centered. It is wrong and grave moral offense against society. You should be in prison for a felony. Some people say, what's the big deal if I want to pay for extra tomatoes? Why can't I? The big deal is you are being greedy and selfish. You are committing grave moral offenses against humanity. That just cannot be tolerated. Perhaps what we should do is organize a boycott. We should say, no way, we are not going to put up with those high prices. Some people are refusing to buy tomatoes because of the high prices. These people are saying, prices are too high, I don't want to buy it. In their mind, it's not a boycott in the political sense, but a gut reaction to the market. It's more an economic move than any political sentiment. We could be like Cesar Chavez in his great boycott. We could frame it in terms of oppression. We could say that the tomato producing companies are taking it out on us. Just as there's a problem when somebody takes their life difficulties out on you, the tomato companies should not take their difficulties out on us. It is just wrong. I bet if we did organize a boycott, the prices would go even higher. Therefore, there would be an even bigger problem, even higher acceleration in prices. Fortunately, folks, there's good news. I hear the next round of the tomato season was not affected by the hurricane in the same way the first crop was. Therefore, there shouldn't be a shortage for all that much longer. I hear prices are supposed to go down. I've already seen Roma's drop. The other types haven't quite dropped yet, but Roma's seem to be doing so. That is wonderful news because Tomato lovers everywhere adore it. Good evening.